Hi, welcome to Badra Electronics. I am Deepak Shurudrapa. I love to give a video presentation on this ECU training. You can find me at support at the rate badraelectronics.com. So if you wanted to do any mail assignments, you can directly submit to this mail ID. So I will revert you with a proper assignment. What you submitted is correct or not. Actually, we are located in India and we are one of the best training center in the entire globe. So we are having almost all the students from most of the countries and you are one of the country among them. Here are the list of topics in this video. Number one, how to sign up for online training. Second one, how to use Excel training classroom application. Third one, tools required for ECU training. Fourth one, jobs and advantages of this ECU training. And the last one is the total content of this training. So let's start with the first one, how to sign up for the online training. This is one of the most important step. So I hope you all guys are the freshers for this domain and you want to know how this online platform will going to work for our training. So for these things, first we need to open the Google Chrome and we need to type Badra electronics.com and here is a login button just click on this login button and here you can see mail id and password but we are not having any mail id and password first we need to go for registration click on registration and here you need to enter your email id here for example i will going to enter with one of the mail id student badra123 at the rate gmail.com so this is one of the students email id and we need to enter the student as a name called student only so we need to check the status yes it shows in a green color now it's available and we need to enter the name for example student student and student yes and we need to enter the password and we need to enter the password so we need to enter the month and we need to enter the gender and we need to select the country it's India just we need to enter the phone number and click on register okay now it is asking for the password to save in your Google ID I don't want that now the final thing we need to open the Google Chrome one more time and go for your Gmail account click on this Gmail account now we need to go for the student account and you will get one mail from the Excel classroom just click on this and just confirm your mail if you just click on confirm your mail means now your account is active so by this way we can just sign up our application that's all about how to sign up for the online training next one how to use excel classroom application this is one of the most important thing i will going to give a very simple demonstration about this classroom application we need to sign up for the application so that is called student badra123 at the rate gmail.com and we need to enter the password and click on login so now it is opening the dashboard of the training portal so here you will get a list of total training topics actually so but no problem we will going to learn the entire details one by one this is the dashboard of the actual student or who got enrolled for this training if we finish the day one class means day two class will be assigned automatically for the next day or else if you request for the earliest means that will be also available in Badra Electronics you can go in to watch that classes for the next day also now for example if you wanted to watch this one means just click on this the basic car electronics modules means so you scroll down you will get a total three videos if you just click on this means you will get to see the all video content like this if you just click on this means it will open the video content on the screen so I don't want to play this one 
it will be paused like this only and you can see the list of total videos what we are having in the entire training and after that you can download the documents also if you just click on this download means the document will go into download automatically in your google chrome so by this way we can watch our entire training in very easy method so in this content directly you need to go for this video section and you can watch these videos and here are the documents also you can see by this way we can use this dashboard very easily that's all about the topic of how to use this excel classroom application next one what are the tools required for our ecu training this is one of the biggest question for this online enrolling students actually but here is a solution i will give you the step by step procedures also for these problems so number one soldering blower is required soldering iron is required soldering wire is required soldering wig is required soldering flux and various type of soldering tips also required esd mat also required tweezers different type of tips also and one magnifier or mobile or maybe from any digital camera means you can see and magnifies the image very clear and the last one is multimeter it's really most important but if you are using lcr meter also no problem or maybe auto range multimeter also no problem so these all the tools you can buy from the local electronic stores those are our readily available in your local market only here are the list of ecus and programming tools actually here are the list of ecu and ecm programmers so what are the most important tools required for our training means the first one is what ktag that's why i mentioned in the symbol of this star mark so these star marks are like a mandatory tools for our job actually so what are the tools required means the first one is what we required ktag and we required the ktm bench if you are going to purchase this online tool means this fc tool is very most important and next if you're possible to purchase this vvd pro means this is dedicatedly for bcm programming and other stuff and this one is what vvd mini key tool and this is dedicatedly for key programming purpose and this is diagnostic tool so if you are going to purchase with a 508 or 608 from the atul brand or maybe from the other brands also means it will be really great for us so this all the tools you also you can buy from this china and that website name is called autochips.com so from this you can directly buy directly from this vendor to your country it's very easy to purchase from them and there will be no headache from this sellers that's all about the topic of tools required for ecu training and the very most important topic that is called fourth one jobs and advantages of this ecu training Let's see the different types of jobs after the finishing of this training number one only diagnostic job using your scanning tool so if you finish this training means maybe you can work as a just a diagnostic person in your city second job you can work on both maybe diagnostic and with electrical also third job you can get a three type of three levels of jobs in your workshop or maybe your city or maybe your locality maybe working as a diagnostic maybe working as a electrician maybe working as a ecm repair also and the fourth job is diagnostic electrical ecm repair and key programming also you can work maybe if you are become expert in this two segments means you will be the master in the entire job actually but this is not only the end job number 5 we are having so obviously you finish this ecm repair and key making but you are having a plenty options like online coding calibrations airbag reset eps bcm programming abs test frm reset and other category so this much of jobs you will going to get in this training also so i will repeat this one more time i will repeat this one more time in this training you will not only get this ecm services and key programming you will going to learn the next content like online coding calibrations airbag reset eps bcm abs frm model and others also so by this way you can enhance your knowledge by joining this up to the level of 5 and the job number 6 is called remapping tuning performance of stage 1 2 3 dtc emo and other stuffs but these are not included in this training this is a totally different training and the seventh job you can work in the development also in the IT industry after finishing of this training so by this way you will get a plenty of jobs in this domain let's start with the fifth unit 
training topics. In this page you will going to get a total topics of 1 to 8. In next page you will going to get topics of 9 to 17. In next page you will going to get 18 to 25. And the last page you will get 26 to 32. Let's see all these topics one by one. In first unit you will going to learn on ECM ECO training topics on batteries and how to check car leakage and fixing procedures. Second topic petrol engine sensors and actuator working circuit testing using P100 with a live data sheet and wiring diagram. Third topic diesel engine sensors and actuator working circuit testing using P100 with a live data sheet and wiring diagram. Fourth topic electronics multimeter and testing component. Fifth topic how components works in a circuit. Sixth topic types of relays and fuses. Seventh topic introduction to ECM architecture Bosch, Siemens, Continental, Denso, Delphi. Eighth one what are the difference between a controller and op-amp, an voltage regulator, a driver IC, H-bridge IC, an injector IC, types of transistors, diodes, resistors, capacitors, MOSFETs, fuses, inductor. Ninth one, why do we need to do reverse engineering for ECM and what is the purpose of line tracking? Line tracking Euro 2, 10th topic line tracking euro 3 and euro 4 11th topic line tracking magnet marali 12th topic line tracking bosch edc 17 series 13th soldering work 14th diagnostic procedures using atl im 508 diagnostic procedures number 2 communication table t slash r module and german cars online coding 16th one diagnostic procedures commercial vehicle diagnosis jal test and comments 17th one sensor testing using oscilloscope and diagnostic tool 18 how to diagnose ecm problems how to test ecu is working or not after repair 19th one introduction and ecm programming in ktac procedures ecm repair videos and procedures also 20th ecu programming in ktm bench pcm tuner fc 200 21 ECU programming by KT200 Flux Hexproc2 Installation Procedures OBD Star DC706 22 ECU Cloning Procedure 23 Key Programming Procedure OBD2 Atul Training Academy and Bench Method 24 XORS VVDI Mini Key Tool 25 Flash EEPROM Hex Table Mapping in Flux 26 Odometer Programming Procedure 27 Injector coding and ECU repair procedures. 28. TCU programming and repair process FC200 flux. 29. Airbag repair and programming procedure. 30th. EPS calibration and repair procedure. 31. ABS coding, diagnosis and repair procedure. 32. BCM programming procedure using VVDI Pro application and FRM module. Reset with other functions from the VDI Pro application. By this way, we can see this total of 32 units. If you finish this 32 units, means you can easily become a successful repair person. And you can do the payment through by PayPal or maybe online banking. And if you contact us our with a technical team, means they will provide you the payment link of the PayPal. Or else, if you are planning to do payment through by online banking, means you can directly go for the Google Chrome. Here is the home page of our training. So go for the training section, car ECM training. Just scroll down. For international students payment details, just click on downloads. You can see one of the form which you can download directly from the Google. So here is the payment details and you can see our bank account details also, Swift code also and the bank name and routing code also and with IFC code also. You can directly download from our website only. For this respected account details also you can do the fund transfer. Based on that also we can going to give access for you through by the online platform. We are heartily welcome you to the Badra family. Best wishes from Deepak Shodrapa.